shows this particular breed of sheep is um, it is renowned to be one of the best tasting sheep. Um, and uh, we, we found this out pretty quickly. Um, we uh, butchered some of our um, wethers last year. Here's a picture of them hanging in the, in the butcher's um, freezing freeze room. They could not let me go in and have a look. Uh, and the, the meat, the breed of sheep is a slow maturing breed. And when you think about animals, you really have this constant ba battle between tenderness and test. So the earlier you cull an, an animal, whether it's a cow or, or a sheep, the less taste it will have. But the tenderer the, the meat will be. Think of veal, for example. There really isn't much of a taste of it, but it's incredibly succulent and tender. The beautiful thing about the Wiltshire horns is that they're slow maturing. So you can imagine that if you were to get the tenderness and the taste at the one time, then you got magic. And that's really what we've noticed with our breed in terms of the taste. You get both, both benefits. Of course, there's pros and cons of that. You have the animal longer on your property, but for us, we don't mind. We can cope with having that animal for two or three extra months because you get more value for your property from, from your animal. And it's not, you're not, we're not worried about having, carrying a, a maximum capacity or whatever it might be. So you really get a lovely balance um, as well. Um, some of the comments just recently from the butchers, we just got some more done, and they just said they were perfect. Um, perfect fat covering, and they were able to hang them for three or four days, which is, which is good in terms of what a butcher is going to be effective for a butcher. And then in terms of the amount of meat you actually get from them, um, at about and the ideal time to eat uh, a Wilshire horn is at about 13 or 14 months. For a lot of animals that you find in the supermarkets, you're eating that animal maybe six months old. So just to kind of give you an idea of, uh, of again, the 